Cross-tag battle episode Persona 4. The last left off, we ended the Platinum and Jubei. And we also found Kanji. So we've kind of round up the entire uh, the entire Persona group here, except Naoto. And I guess, but I don't know if we'll see I guess. And uh, we fought them. Obviously, Kanji wanted the pet Jubei, as as he would want. And now we're here. Yeah, if not for our Personas, they probably would have defeated us in the blink of an eye. If not for your Personas, you'd just be normal teenagers. Come to think of it. We still don't know what this place is or why we can use our personas here. Probably because the the deity here allows it. Huh? Yeah. I guess you're right. But man, the real shame here is that I wasn't Oh, shut up. No cat. it isn't. Forget about the cat already. I agree. Did you not notice that we're constantly being assaulted? At least pretend to be worried. I guess, but we're used to finding ourselves in unusual places. It's not that big a deal. I mean, you're not wrong, but still the bigger issue is why we're fighting cats in the first place. I think the bigger issue is that I gotta lug this chair around me everywhere we go. That's what we were trying to figure out. Catch up, man. Well, it might sound irresponsible, but since we're all here, I feel like things might just work out. Huh. You just don't have a care in the world. Much like now, Kanji. But honestly, it's kind of nice that we're all together like this. Even if Kanji is useless for coming up with a plan. That's true. If Naoto were here, things would be completely different. Yeah, she's really smart. She's over there. What? Are you fucking kidding me? Just ahead. Take a look. Oh my god. Are Against Aurier and Lene. Huh? Two girls? One tiny one and another in an ornate dress. It seems like they're talking. Uh, sounds like a fight waiting to happen. <laughs> Calm down. Naoto's alone, and the rules require a two-person tag team. They're not going to attack her. Oh, that's right. Hmm. Huh. But if we head over there, we'll be partnered up and wait, who's missing? God damn it, Kanji. Yeah, of course. Do it all on your own like that. Because... No, no. Who's talking? Wait, Kanji, if you get too close to now, don't. Let's go. I'm sorry. Jesus I don't Christ. have this keystone you're talking about. However, it's possible that I can help you find it. Could you tell me more? Hmm. Doesn't seem like she knows anything. Talking to her is a waste of time. You don't have to be so rude. Hey, hey Naoto. Huh? Tatsumi-kun, no. why are you here? No. <laughs> Don't worry about that. Are you okay? No. <laughs> I, I am. I just didn't expect that you would be here, Tatsumi-kun. You caught me just as I was asking these people for information. No, 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 no! How many of you are here? <laughs> it's good to see you, Narukami-senpai. I'm glad you're safe, Naoto. Likewise. Lower your gun! Is this all? For Christ's sake! Oh, huh? You seem awfully collected, Detective Prince. This is everybody we found. So far. I see. For my part, I suddenly found myself in this place and started to explore. That's how I found myself here. You're the first familiar faces I've seen. Hmm. Wait, do you mean you ran into people you didn't know? Did they attack you or anything? No, I didn't run into any issues. I did discover that this is not the TV world, though. Mm -hmm. Tell me something I don't Some know. Some of the scenery was familiar, but other parts were unlike anything I've ever seen. There are no shadows here. Nor can I hear anyone's voice. However, I can use my persona, and I do have my weapon. In other words, I'm ready for battle. Wow, you basically reasoned everything out. <laughs> Hardly. Hardly. There's still a lot I don't know. Senpai, have you heard of something called a keystone? I have yep, one. I was holding it when I first arrived. We were told that we can't get out of here without it. I see. So it's necessary to escape. Hmm. So that's a keystone. Oh, shit, Lene. It's much more portable than I expected. So, who are these people? They were looking for the keystone. In other words, they're trying to escape this place just like us. That's right. Huh? Well, hold up. I know how this story usually ends. <laughs> this worked out quite nicely. I'll have you hand over that keystone now. <gasps> oh, I knew it! <laughs> Please wait. You don't intend on taking it by force, do you? Oh, as somebody who's very into the thought of justice and, you know, doing things her own way, you're, 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 you're not having issues with this? It all depends on them. I don't think I'd kill any of them, at least. But what's going on here? Are they seriously trying to rob us of the Keystone? That's what I want to know. Why does everyone we run into always end up fighting us? They're every bit as much victims of this world as we are. 
There's no need for violence. You understand, don't you, Princess of the Nightblade? <sighs> You're always such a goody two shoes. These goddamn Lick Christ girls. Ridiculous. Please, Lick Christ and Nightblade working together. <laughs> no. Ridiculous though it may be, what's wrong is wrong. Wrong, 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 absolutely wrong. <sighs> This is why I can't stand your absurd obsession with justice. There we are. Fine. For now, we're allies. We'll settle this later. If we get back alive, that is. Wait a minute. It's not about getting in a fight later. It's about not fighting at all. Hey! But aren't the two of them fighting? What should we do? Should we duck out while we have the chance? Yeah. Yes. It doesn't seem like that obnoxious you-know-what is going to show up either. You-know-what? Uh, no, no, God damn it! Probably referring to me. Yeah, that's right. That thing with the irritating voice. And come on, seriously. <laughs> How is your timing so good? I love you, Yosuke. What? You thought I would hear you? I really do well, love you, you dude. Wrong. I'm practically clairvoyant. It's like the voices in our heads. Could it be a support type persona user? Uh, whatever it is, it's probably not a good thing that they have a direct line to our brain. Oh, who cares about Lelo me? <laughs> How about that tag battle? Oh my god. In the end, it all comes down to this. Good. Hey, moderator, hurry up and start the fight. Maybe that'll shut Aurier up. Moderator. Hey, why do you keep... Ask and ye shall receive. Ten seconds until the bell. What? If entrants are not decided by then, it will count as a forfeit, and the losers will be subject to a truly embarrassing punishment. As per our new rule. Wait, you totally just made that up. <laughs> That's, That's great. not fair. Guess we're doing this. Come on, Yosuke. Me? All right, let him have it, Hanamura. Damn it, fine. Watch my back, partner. Man, what I want to give to be able to play is Naoto. But she's DLC, so of course we can't have any Get of that. Ready. Okay, well, let's see if Yosuke's uh, speediness can go up against Lene's exit speed star. Can't escape from crossing fate. I love her theme. Fight. That's nothing. Pressure. All over the damn place. Here we go. Boom. Awesome. How careless. Boom. And a big kick from Jiraiya. I'm, I'm like I'm growing on Yosuke. It seems they've outfoxed us. We have to retreat, Princess of the Nightblade. Damn, I underestimated them. <laughs> Damn right, get out of here. Looks like we beat him. I love you. I love Under Night. I promise. Jeez, did not think those two girls would be so strong. I'm sorry, I acted so rashly. You gotta stop underestimating people around here, Yosuke. It was a mistake to bring up the Keystone so casually. I didn't expect that they would attack. It's fine. Nobody's hurt or anything. Oh, right. Naoto kun, you're not up to speed yet, are you? Hanamura, explain. Right. <laughs> so Hanamura, explain. Wait, since when am I the designated thing explainer? <laughs> nice. Oh, so you were trying to get information too. At least from those willing to talk. I just ran from anyone who tried to attack me. I guess my instincts were wrong about those two though. I don't blame yourself. It's not like they came at you with their weapons ready or anything. That's true. But I made the mistake of dropping my guard to get <coughs> information. Mm -mm. I swear, if Kanji hadn't gone berserk, maybe you could have gotten something out of him. <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> I don't mind. I doubt I would have gotten any useful information even if Tatsumi-kun hadn't appeared. Anyway, I tried asking earlier, but is this everybody that has been brought here from our world? Mm, we're missing I guess. Oh, and we're also missing the data mine people. If you'd like me to spoil those for you, those are, uh... And... So yeah, all those guys. <laughs> They're coming. I think so. 
Nobody's seen so much as a trace of Teddy Arise. Well, in our circle of friends. Neither of you are coming, unfortunately. So why us? Did they pick us for a reason? It's not a matter of location. Narakami-kun is here, after all. Ooh, maybe we're chosen descendants of heroic bloodlines! What? <laughs> Can you take this seriously? Hold on. I think I might know. Teddy-kun and Kujikawa-san are both capable navigators. Maybe whatever brought us here wanted to keep us in the dark. Huh? So what? It, it wants to split us all up or something? No. It's more that... It wants to keep us from evading our enemies. What do you mean? Why would it want that? The humans in this world... Well, humans might not quite be an accurate term. In Every births. one of them knew that someone in our group had a key item, so to speak. You've been getting in fights ever since you arrived here, correct? Oh yeah, one after another with no time to rest. But if Teddy-kun or Kujikawa-san were here, you likely would have been able to avoid some of those battles. I don't know where the designated goal is, but those two would have made getting there a lot easier. Very true. Which would mean whoever brought us here is deliberately making us hold the key item and enabling these battles with everyone we meet. Which I'm starting to get a little sick of, honestly. Exactly. Someone out there has something to gain from all this fighting. And while this is just a theory, I think that the voice we heard earlier is controlling people here to some extent. I don't agree with that one. At least through the rules it has established. There we go. Yeah, that, that makes voice more is sense. the one who keeps starting. It's probably designed Whoopsies. to encourage the people in this world to fight each other. Oh, I have a bad feeling about this. That would mean that the voice is the one behind all of this, right? That. Or the voice is simply an emissary. Either way, it's likely that holding on to the keystone and continuing to fight will eventually achieve the mastermind's objective. But to be optimistic, perhaps the realization of that objective will allow us to be released. You kidding? Whatever this punk's after can't be good. We can't just play along. I feel the same way. I don't like this place. It feels as though our memories have been projected onto something abnormal. Yeah, it's pretty creepy, especially the way it mixes in places we're familiar with. If the Mastermind knows everything about us and is arranging all of these fights, should we really keep moving forward? I don't know. Moving forward seems to be our only option. Oh, it's frustrating to know that we're doing what the Mastermind wants us to do. But I think it's the only way for us to approach the truth. Agreed. Returning to our world is important, but that's not our only concern. Yeah, I don't know what they're up to, but if it's something bad... We'll crush them! We'll beat them up! <laughs> you ever think we're a little too used to these crazy situations? But we've got no other choice! We can't just leave the culprit be, can we? <laughs> no, we can't. But we have to be cautious. If there's any way we can avoid combat, we should. Yeah, come on, everyone. Wow, that was a lot of plot there. I was, I was pretty damn into that. We're back here again? Seriously? Oh my god, that was that was really interesting. I'm not gonna lie. I really like that a lot. We almost got the entire investigation team here too. Well, as most of this game is gonna allow us to have. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button to leave a comment of another such a play in the future. And I will see you guys next time. Later!